What's up guys, Nick Nick Knock here. I just wanted to show you guys some Easter egg gameplay on Origins. I have all the staffs built, put them all in the robot's head. And now I'm on step three, Reign of Fire. So, this is, this is it. I was trying to get in the other foot, but... And I got so sick of waiting, I just finally said, you know, what the hell would it let him kill the zombies and everything, and I just went in the opposite foot. Okay, I'm going to try this, and I, I had it in my mind, okay, if it doesn't make it this round, I'm going to quit and start over, because it's getting too late in the rounds, and I'm not going to be able to do, like, the punches downstairs and a few other things, but, eh. I got pretty lucky with it. I don't know if I'm the if I'm the first person to do it from this left side. I haven't really looked up um, too many videos. I've seen Spider Bite do it on the right side. Um, well, on the robot's left side, I'm doing it on the right side right now. And punch, throw it right there in that open hole, and sure enough, fucking right there. That was a hell of a shot. I was kind of stoked whenever I did that, but. Um, Yeah, there we go. Rain of fire. So now you have to unleash the horde, which is uh, you have to go grab a Maxis drone and just let him go right here, and he'll find his way into the hole, to the hole, and unleash a bunch of those big daddy pens of soul dad zombies. I don't know what people call them, big daddies, but I uh, I think I like saying big daddy that more than pens of soul dad. It just I don't know, the Panda sold that thing it makes me feel weird every time I say it. Because everybody's else like, wait, what's it called? So, I don't know. I just say Big Daddy because that's what everybody else says. I don't want to try to be better than the noobs, you know. Come on now. Okay, here we go. Here we got one Big Daddy, two Big Daddy, three Big Daddy, four. I know I said that before they came out, but... Yeah, I might only be three, I don't know. But it looks like there was only four that came out, but... uh I definitely had to end up killing seven of them, so I don't know if it was late round I was in or what, but yeah, you gotta kill like seven of them. I haven't, I haven't seen how many other people have been killing. I haven't really watched too, too much on this. Yeah, see if you see in the background, a couple more just dropped down as I killed the first two. I guess I kill one, another one drops. Definitely wanted to keep that zombie right there, but I couldn't do nothing about it. The round started, so, yeah. Can't stay in one spot and try to kill these guys anymore. I'm about to run like a little train. The panzers are, are faster than the zombie, so you can just run away really quick. And, uh, you, you, you just how quick, you see how quick I is? Stamina up is the shit in this game. No, <laughs> no, but, uh, you can run away real quick and yet again have a little one-on-one -on -one time with the panzer. So, okay, there we go. I finished the last guy, so I'm going to shoot the plane and kill the pilot now. Skewer the winged, skewer the winged beast. So, uh, this is the best way to do this, is to start off with, uh, with, with the little chariots. Go ahead and shoot these chariots and get your, your free blood money, or your blood, uh, your zombie blood. I don't know why I didn't. You should, and you should go up the other way of the excavation shot. I don't know why I went this way. You can't shoot it down with the uh, Mark II or the staff. So, well, I mean, you probably can't do it with the Mark II, but it'll take you a long time. This is the easiest way to do it, just to find it and do do do. Shoot right there with the AK-47, and I end up going back down and getting another staff later on. Um, I'm waiting right here. I think it took me one round, and I get my zombie blood. I didn't even know it. I kind of ran right into it, but. Uh, if you see, I don't know if you've seen it just now, the zombie kind of fell out of the right of the sky. So you kind of kind of see where he drops from. Uh, I've done it four times now, and he, I've always killed him right here next to the back entrance to the church. So um, that's my advice is I'd, I'd go down there. I'd go up there, but right after I got that kill, I went straight down uh and started the round, started the next round so I can start getting my kills. It's round 25 down here. Getting a little hectic, you might want to try to get it done faster, but I couldn't, I couldn't. So, uh, 
round 25, I'm getting excited, almost getting trapped. So okay, I'm about to complete this baby solo. So I run to Agartha thinking, I mean to the crazy place thinking, okay, I'm gonna start getting my kills. And then I realize like, oh shit, man, I gotta put in every single staff by myself. I don't have anybody else to help me. So I finally do that. I go run back and forth, 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 putting all the staffs in. And um, yeah, one thing that really helped me right here, exactly, the airstrikes. The airstrikes helped me a lot. Something you got to know is they don't kill the zombies down here. All they do is hoard them up. I guess the plane hits like they shoot. It shoots like the bombs at the roof. But it doesn't ever blow up the zombies, if you notice. Look, I thought it did blow the zombies up. I come over here and I see the whole horde. I'm like, wait, wait, what the? But luckily, insta-kill going on. And I'm feeding the beast up in the sky. I mean, I was feeding Jesus. I don't know. That was bad. That was bad. Shouldn't have said that. Especially while playing zombies. All right, so this is it with a Claymore kill. Boom. That's, that does it for me. And, uh, of course, you release Max's your drone to the sky. I try to stand in it. There is a, uh, from Xbox, from the first time I did it on Xbox, you just stand in the light, and and it sucks you up. You don't have, like, an option to do it or not to do it or whatever. Once you stand in the light, you have, like, five seconds in the light, and the easter is complete. Well, I get the, the achievement, and I stand in the light, and nothing. So I run out. But as I was running out, I did see a little square that says hold to teleport. So I go back in here, and I'm pressing square, pressing it, pressing it, pressing it, pressing it, and nothing's happening. Nothing's happening. I'm pressing the teleport button, nothing's happening. So I finally say, you know what, I'm not going to die. Might as well just go for a high round. I ended up staying until 62 in this, uh, in this game, just running around here with the staffs, but... Uh, this was kind of like before it was well known about the Fire Staff G spawn error. I guess once you shoot them in a high round, and I've seen it happen to numerous people in the 60s, like whenever you get to round 60 or so, the Fire Staff just starts giving you that spawn error. So look, here it goes right here. I stand in it, I look up, and that's when I see the teleporter thing. And I keep pressing, 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 and it won't let me in the Easter egg and give me the cutscene. So. Uh, I actually went on to tell a few of my friends that you couldn't get the cutscene solo, and uh, they actually went and and did it. They got the cutscene solo, so that's just proof. But there's a zombie wielding a staff right there. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm gonna end on that, and um, yeah, hope you guys can attempt this, maybe get it done, cause uh, I don't know. I found it a lot harder to do it multiplayer. I tried it a bunch, a bunch, a bunch of times with uh, with a few other people. You can never get it done, but I've uh, I've only been able to complete this uh, solo, but I've completed it multiple times solo. So I don't know. Maybe it's just a, something uh, with setting up. Setting up for the Easter egg on this uh, particular map is ten times worse than any other map that you've ever had. I mean, you have to get Thunder Fist, you have to get the Airstrike Grenade, you have to upgrade to Thunder Fist, build all four staffs, do all this stuff by uh, a respectable round. You can't get too high into it, or some of the steps are. Uh, just a little too difficult to complete. So um, try this solo if you're having too much, too much, you know, too much difficulty in multiplayer. Peace.